Welcome back. Today we are going to look into regression analysis. So in bivariate data we will have two variables. One will be known as a dependent variable and another one is independent variable. Y variable and X variable. So when we plot the scatter plot. For example something like this. So what we are going to do is. We are going to fit a straight line, okay? Or we are going to draw a straight line. So the straight line must be fit in between these points and it must be evenly distributed. So here, for example, I can draw a straight line, something like this. So the points or the point, the plots are going to be evenly distributed and this line known as regression line. Okay, the straight line that we're going to draw in a scatter plot we know as a regression line. Okay, <coughs> and this regression line will have the equation since it is a straight line. So we're going to have a straight line equation where it's going to be y equal to mx plus c. So here your m it's going to be a gradient okay or the slope of the line c is going to be y intercept okay and then to find the M and C or the gradient and the C we have the formula so to find an M or gradient it's going to be R multiplied by square root of S Y Y divided by square root of S X X and the formula for S X X and X S Y Y I have given you in previous class okay in finding the co Pearson correlation coefficient and then to find the y intercept or c value so c value is going to be the <coughs> the mean of y mean of y minus m the mean of x okay so the mean of y minus the mean of m multiplied by mean of x the mean value okay so these are the formula to find the m and c or gradient and y intercept <coughs> okay let's look at an example so here I give an example this is a previous example where to find the s x x s x s y y and the r value we have looked into the previous class okay and then to find the mean of x and mean of y so mean of x is going to be 1 plus 1 plus 3 plus 5 divided by 4 and mean of y 2 plus 8 plus 6 plus 4 divided by 4 so I get 2.5 and I got 5 okay so I write here yeah if now we are going to find the linear regression equation okay linear line equation okay so it's going to be we represent this y equal to m x plus c where for m is going to be <coughs> r multiplied by s y y square root divided by s x negative 0 0.1348 multiply square root 20 divided by square root 11 sorry square root 10 oops sorry it should be 11 sorry so my r value is negative
So my m value is negative 0 0.1818. Okay. <coughs> <coughs> so to find my c is going to be mean of y pi minus this value also plus minus minus negative 0 0.1818. 2.5 okay so it's going to be 5 plus 0.1818 so it's going to be 5.4545 okay therefore the equation of linear regression is going to be y is equal to negative 0 0.1818x plus 5.45 okay so this will be one of the example let's look into another example okay, now here I give you an example <coughs> a study to find relationship between the height of husband x and the height of their wife y revealed the following details so mean of x x is her husband's height 180 mean of y 169 sxx 5.3 square syy 4.48 square and then r value equal to 0 0.85 and then i ask you to find the equation of the regression line so it's going to be Okay, so y equal to mx plus c. So find your m first, r multiplied by square root of syy over sxx. So going to be 0 0.85 into 4.8 over 5.3 square, which is going to be. <coughs> times by r is 0.85 so it's going to be 0 0.7698 and then to find the c value to find the c value is going to be y mean of y 169 minus 0 0.7698 into 180 I got 30.436 okay therefore height of wife equivalent to m which is 0 0.7698 multiplied by height of husband plus c 30.436 okay so this is going to be the regression equation or regression line equation so from here we can predict what is the height of wife if uh, given a husband's height for example i give you the husband's height okay i just erase the whole thing and just rewrite this Okay, I just erase and rewrite. So now here, I mentioned I give you the equation height of y equal to 0 0.6798 times by height of husband plus 30.436. So predict the height of wife given height of husband is 195. So height of wife is going to be equal to so going to be
So here I got approximately 180.547. So approximately the height going to be 181 cm. Okay. So by using the regression line, we can predict for the data they doesn't give us. So that is going to be regression line equation. Thank you.